Yeah, you know, I mean, like I told, like, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'm, I'm from a small hood in Marcy. I come from a project, I come from nothing, like, people are very... Don't trust our opinion. Don't trust our opinion podcast. It's your boys back in the building. It's your boy OJ. It's your boy Kev. Here we are once again, man. Uh, we made it to 40k, yo. 40k, we man. Made it to 40k, Big man. Milestone, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so now, yeah. uh, let's try to make it to 40. I mean, 50k, yeah. We're not trying to make it back to 40k. Don't like, unsubscribe. You know what I'm saying? Don't. But let's make it to 50k. You know, all of our uh, opinionators out there. So this is Tom Segura. Is saying midget really like saying the N word? Um, <laughs> we did something similar to this. Yeah, we did. Before I remember us talking about it, right? Yeah. Um, and no, it's not. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's clearly it's not. But for comedic purposes, yeah, it's funny. So let's get into it. Yeah. Let's talk about public enemy number one, midgets. Seriously, I cannot get enough of that show. Don't you love that show, the midget show? They don't call they call it little people, big world. I call it the midget show because it's about midgets. Now if you haven't seen the show, there's a little midget couple and they have kids. Now they have a set of twins. Now the first twin, let's call him really lucky, because he's like 6'2. What? I don't know how they do that. How did that happen? <laughs> then they have another son, not so lucky. He's however tall this is. Here. Now the best part of the show is watching the little midget son play soccer, right? It's like a video game. You're like, turbo, 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 go, 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 go. And you don't see legs. You're like, is that a ball? No, that's him. He's yeah. lazy. But here's the thing. I feel so guilty every time I watch that show because I'll eat a box of Keebler elf cookies and they're delicious. And so are midgets. Midgets are edible. Did you know that? No, you didn't. <laughs> Press pause. Next time you see midgets. Press pause. I've heard midget is a hurtful word. You know what I'm saying? Um, well, I wouldn't call a midget a midget. Uh huh. Yeah. I'd call them by their name. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. But if, if I'd be like, yo, like suppose your friend was a little person, right? right? Mm. And um, I'd be like, yo, like, yo, Kev, like, um, yo, who you with? And you say that person's name, mm -hmm. and then um, I'd be like, yo, I didn't know he was. A, I don't, I don't, I don't finish the sentence. <laughs> if you would say that, if you was to say that, uh -huh. then they can punch your kneecaps. <laughs> <That's all good. laughs> yeah, yeah, he, yeah. That's something you would save. You know, just do it how like racist people do it. You know, yeah. they wait till they get behind doors. They be like, well, you just hanging out with a midget. <laughs> Were you just hanging out with a little fella? That's how I think all racist people too. Do you think racist? <laughs> yeah, little fella? Are you just hanging out with Like I said, right? Yeah, yeah. Midgets. If you ever encounter a midget, it's good luck. Cause they're rare. You rarely see midgets. You rarely see when the last time you seen a midget? Go. The last time I seen a midget? Um damn. Like in person. Damn, that's a good one. Probably like four years ago. Probably exactly. Years and ago. when you see a midget, doesn't it give you like a sense of happiness? Yeah, I mean, yeah. Or excitement. It doesn't yeah. have to be happiness. But yeah, like see I see a midget, I, you be like, oh, snap. You be like, oh, shit. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Like you automatically observe it. You look at it. I'm I mean, not to call it an it. You look at the person. You call it an it. <laughs> you look at the person. That's like. Hey, y'all know what I'm talking about. If it's you like see a thousand a midget, subscribers down the drain. <laughs> we got a thousand midgets? You never know. Little people. Little people, man. I think little people's worse, though. You don't think so? I mean, it's like more degrading. Like, yo, what up, little, little dude? That's like calling him little dude. Yeah, it is. It is. I don't know, man. Like, it's, it's I don't know. Of, it's I rough, have no, no hate towards midgets. Um, I'm a short person. Yeah, yeah. I was almost a midget. Yeah. I'm probably like the evolved stage of midget. <laughs> like, I'm like a midget, <laughs> too. Let's just move on. Yeah, yeah, we, we, 
we I'm, we sorry we people. Fuck up a whole we're, we're sorry. We're sorry. We're, we're sorry. We're just joking around. Here's something I did not know. I did not know that midgets hate to be called midgets. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. I don't care. They're midgets. Like we're not gonna do anything. You know, like. Hey, oh man. Most people are midgets. I've had some bad like exchanges with midgets. Okay. First of all, they're always in a bad mood. Okay, they're all. <laughs> Which I find kind of bizarre because they walk like there's a really happy song playing in their heads. You know? <laughs> What's the problem, dude? So I'm doing a show in Arizona a few weeks ago. I'm talking to somebody like at human height, like up here after the show. Jesus and Christ. The midget comes up behind me and you know, he wants to talk, so he <laughs> Oh my god, he's <laughs> shit right now. <laughs> okay. So I know he's there, but I want him to have fun. And I wanna have fun too. So I start to go like, you know, like Oh man. Mm -hmm. And he's like, I know you can fucking see me. I know you can fucking see me. So then I go, does Santa know you're here? Right? And he's very upset at this point. And he starts to lecture me, you know? He goes, you know, you shouldn't say midget. You shouldn't say midget. You should say little people. You shouldn't say midget. And I'm like, why not? And he goes, because saying midget is like saying nigger. And I was like, whoa. Ooh. First of all, we're both white. And if somebody hears you, I'm not protecting you. <laughs> Secondly, <laughs> it's not the same thing because our ancestors didn't own midgets, all right? Not unless they won some crazy high stakes poker game that was like, I'm going all in, plus the court jesters. And you're like, pair of kings, I'm fucked. Now, I wish they did. I wish my parents were like, Tom, your great grandfather, he owned like 40 midgets. Because I'd be like, get the fuck out of here. Do we still get them? And if we did, I would take my midgets and I would put little bowls on their heads and I would fill them with different types of dip and salsa and I would have them walk around so I could scoop out whatever I felt like eating. Want some hummus? Get the fuck over here. You guys were a lot of fun. Thanks a lot. Have a great night. <laughs> All I'm gonna say is, <clears throat> just say it. Man. This is listen. If there, if you, ha if they, uh, and I like Tom Segura. We, right? Yeah, we like Tom Segura. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you an example, right? Yeah. It's like certain traditions have certain things to them that they should just keep within, so yeah. it doesn't offend anybody, right? Yeah. For instance, for gay people, the f word. Yeah. I would never get mad at a gay person being mad at me for saying the f word because yeah. it's been used. Against them, yeah. in a home and it's funny. People are gonna watch this and be like, "Well, you have no problem saying midget." They gonna but say midget that. is. It's not really the same. Like, you don't get beat up for being a midget. You don't like. It's not midget hate crime. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's a good like point. Beating up midgets at a astronomical weight. Like, that's gays a, that's a good point. beat up. And yeah, exactly. It's not like someone's like, "Yo, I'm out the these dead midgets." Yeah, like if you them. beat up a midget, niggas gonna look at you like, really? Yeah, you like, are you really beat up a midget, yeah, bro? Yeah. <laughs> you <know? laughs> like, you feel proud of yourself, or what's good with you, man? And you know what's funny? Like, what story time, right? So, some guy at work, right? He got mad because he's a white guy, right? And he got mad because I gave everybody, like, you know, like, it's a group of white people. I'm at work, corporate, right? Group of white people, shake their hand. You know, you know the thing. You shake their yeah. Hand. And then you see your brother, you see your black man. Yeah. Like, yo, what up? You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> you doing that, right? Uh -huh. So he's like, yo, man, like, you know, why you didn't dab me up? And I'm like, yo, I don't know you, first of all. <laughs> <laughs> right? Second of all, I don't yeah. know. It's just a thing. He's like, yeah. well, if I would have did it, if I would have just um, gave everyone handshakes and then dapped you up, I'd be racist. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I can see where you're coming from, but at the same time, you you would. Yeah, <laughs> that's, yeah, that's the honest. example, yeah. right? That's like me going, like, I can do that because he's black, yeah. right? You can do that to someone because they're white. Like, you give them a handshake because yeah. they're white. Yeah. Now, imagine if I was to go 
It was a bunch of <laughs> black dudes. I'm giving them all that. No, it's a bunch of white people. I'm giving them all Haitians. Mm-hmm. And then I get to the Asian nigga and I go and I bow. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. That's gonna be now, for another Asian nigga do it. It'd be okay yeah. because they're both Asian. And it, <laughs> you know, but if I go to if I if I'm like, hey, how you doing? Yeah, what up? How you doing? And I go to the oh, TJ <laughs> TJ. Like <laughs> that <laughs> would look so fucking bad. Yo, I never thought about that. Yeah. That would look so fucking. So it's bad. like all I'm saying is like keep the race thing into the race thing. Yeah, That's it. you know what I'm saying. I feel like the handshake thing too is like it. The, I think it even sometimes depend on like the black person. Yeah, it does. It could be like some dude off the boat. I'm not dapping some dude off the boat. Like I'm just like, what's up, man? I'm not going to some King Joffrey looking nigga. And, you know, African niggas they be racist too against oh, black people. Yeah, of they course. don't. Of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I, know. I know. It's just a whole thing, man. Yeah. And even with some white people, like there's some white people you can. There's some white people yeah, even dap up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It depends on the setting because you in a corporate spot, so yeah, yeah. You already know, like, but uh, yeah, but like we just went on a tangent, yeah. but um, yeah, man. Uh, not gonna lie, that's not my favorite Tom Segura one. Entertaining. Yeah, I feel like he could have he could have did more with it with the midget joke. Yeah, I think because I've heard it too much. Yeah, so it's it's like it, yeah, it's literally a yeah. lot of bits just like this one. Ralphie made did one. Yeah, Ralphie made to that too. So yeah, but I like Tom Segura. Yeah, we comedian, like Tom Segura, yeah. but don't kill us in the comments too too much for not liking what you guys like. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Just relax. We are own people. <laughs> but holla at your boys. Don't trust our pin. We up. Yeah. I mean, like I told, like, I'm, I'm from a small hood in Marcy. I come from a project. I come from nothing. Like, people are very, 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 um, very poor. That's where I came from. And to be not only a star in your neighborhood, then to be a star in the world, and then to take it even further and be international. That's, that was the war. That's international hip-hop. Actually. I mean, that's beautiful.